Fund. Meet Munira Fumjuma. She is the Catalyst Fund recipient for Her Start, Innovate the Future Project, a project ran by Youth Challenge International. She was born in 1990 and studied psychology at the University of Iringa. Munira is the mother of three and has the full support of YCI during training sessions. YCI provides child services to participants like Munira, so she's able to focus on the growth of her business. To this day, she has been able to employ herself and over 10 people in her community. Munira launched her business back in 2020. To qualify for funding, participants like Munira must go through a two-day training program called Spark Social Innovation. This is then followed by an eight-week program called Seed Your Social Venture. This program is for entrepreneurs like Munira who are looking to expand their knowledge and their business idea. Once this training is completed, participants can apply for funding and enroll to a six-month business coaching program called Grow Your Social Venture. Please describe your business and why you apply to the Catalyst Fund. My business name is Guglioni Clean Line. My team and I collect the garbage around the Guglioni neighborhood to reduce disease and keep the street attractive and clean. I initially applied the Catalyst Fund because I want to purchase a gutter. This is a special garbage collector scooter. Most of staff and members are women. They must walk for distance. A lot of them had their operation due to their giving birth, so I wanted to provide them with a vehicle that will not break their back or affect their health. Can you tell us about some barriers you experienced in the past? My plan was to work in a government sector and get paid. While searching for job, I volunteered for the Ministry of Health. After many years struggling and being unemployed, I volunteered at the Zanzibar Technology Business Incubation, uh, we call ZTBI, where I met Madam Asha, who connected me to Herstat. In 2021, I finally decided to launch Guglioni Clean Line, which has helped me to earn living and employed others. Now, I'm proudly called myself an entrepreneur. How did you know there was a need to collect waste in your community? When the garbage is left without proper management, the public will start throwing the garbage everywhere, and this becomes a health problem for the community. Guglioni Street is not affected by cholera anymore and the big reason is because of new sanitation measures. What impact does your business have in the community? There have been so much positive change. The environment is clean and the people are proud to call Guglioni their home. Hello, my name is Halima, Guglioni Clean Line help me to become employed and support my family. I love that we are keeping the street safe and I also feel like carrying the wheelbarrow from house to house is like exercise. What are your future business plans? Thanks to her start program, I have been able to learn and to visit other business. Most of recently, I visited Jumba Island, which taught me about a new way to prevent fertilizer from smelling bad. I want to use the garbage collected to make and sell fertilizer so my business can grow. Right now, my business only serves Guglioni neighborhood. I will know my business is growing when I start serving all of the surrounding streets. What advice would you give someone who is considering on joining Her Start and starting their own business? I encourage for other women to join the Her Start program. Unfortunately, women's business are small and often don't grow. I feel like Her Start really helps empower women. There are so many business ideas to be part of such as healthcare or agriculture. A social entrepreneur had the power to transform their communities and themselves. Launching a new 
Business is a big step and can be difficult, but women should join and never lose hope. This decision will improve their life and the YCI will be there for you with the catalyst fund and mentoring. Asante sana, my employees are very happy that YCI was able to visit. Asante sana.